If you favor the firebomb containment drive option, you'll go in with that janitor's ID you picked up. It'll be at night when most of the workers are off. You mop the place and plant the bombs where we need them. Seriously? I got a mop? Yeah, yeah, you really do. They'll clock you on the cameras if you're play acting. You also need a fire truck to show up in when the bombs go off, and a getaway car stashed in a quiet place near the bureau so you can torch the truck and get out. The car doesn't have to be anything special. There shouldn't be any heat. Well, what about the other way, with the uh, ninja skills? Now you choose that route, you won't be using the janitor's gear, but we had to cover all the bases. Your FIB paymasters will have to provide you with a chopper and a pilot. Now you fly way up above the building, parachute in, and gain access to the roof here. Now you'll need to be armed to the teeth, mind you, just in case the uh, shit goes down. Mopping or parachuting? Wow, you're making this choice really difficult. Now, Haynes has given us the leftover money from the Polito job to pull this mission, and the crew will be paid out of that. We keep the change. So, what's it gonna be? <laughs> so you do want to mop. Okay, well, you'll need a couple of gunmen. They'll go in with you as firemen. Everything goes to plan. They won't fire a single bullet, but you will be running into a burning high-rise with them, so consider that. Well, should be okay. He's got a few scores left in him. Daryl, uh, I'm not hearing great things, to be honest, but you just might be able to do this with him. Okay, that all look good to you? You are robbing the FIB here. <laughs> and we have a winner. <laughs> Hey, how you doing? Ah, pretty good, under the circumstances. About to knock off a federal government building. Oh, meanwhile, my psychotic former BFF is trying to figure out a way to kill me. But hey, the meds are kicking in, so life's good. Well, exactly. Franklin got us what we need, put those on. Then what? Then head in there and uh, rig up a slightly more sophisticated fire trap than we've got here. So, I'm guessing drapes and scented candle aren't gonna do the trick, huh? No, 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 no. You'll have incendiaries and a remote device. Now, they need to be strategically placed so we can ensure that we still have access to the server and that the structure maintains its integrity. Now, once you get out, trigger the bombs, meet up with Franklin and the crew, and we'll intercept the emergency call, and you all go in as firemen. Oh, got it? Yeah, I got it. Sounds a little idiotic. Well. Under the circumstances, it was the best I could do. And if you remember, you were the one who chose to do it like this. Oh, come on. But, you know, Trevor has a point about you. You whine too much. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, don't even try it. Don't worry. What's the deal with the bureau lick, man? Is it happening? The deal is, I'm about to go in as a janitor. I need you to grab Daryl Johns and Hugh Welsh and wait on my word in the fire truck. All right, man, I'll round them up. Would have been kind of good to have some experience on board, but whatever, man. Call us when you're on your way out. Is it your first day? Go through the turnstile and head up. Yeah, they keep changing the contractors. Yeah, because guys like me keep losing their jobs and agreeing to do this for less. All right, head up.
Dirty mop. Ugh, I'm counting the days until there's an algorithm that can do my job for me. You know you stay too late when the mopping dead show up. All right. They don't work so hard. Building's closing any second. Hey, charge is set. I'm out of the building. Hey, dog, we right around the corner. We got your gear in here with us. Hey, look, everybody cool, right? Because once we pick him up, it's all go, all right? 
How many people can say they took down the FIB LSHQ? Am I right? Detonate the incendiaries, Frank. I'll get this turnout gear on. signal, right? Yep. We'll be the only idiots running into that burning mess. So don't worry. Pull it up there by the curb. Alright, let's get in there. Painkillers all that loose notory weed at the time. Yeah, probably a little bit of both. Cool, dog. Thanks for clearing that shit up. We gotta go across. Take the stairs to the top floor. All right, we're going across to the far stairwell and up to the top floor. Stairs are here. We take them up to 53. Keep going. Almost at the top! Stand back. Removable drive in the server stack on the far wall. I got the drive. Let's go. We ain't got long. Follow me. They're coming down. Look. Thank <laughs> you. 
That explosion must have knocked me out, man. Get to the ride and torch this fire truck as soon as possible.
feel a whole lot better. Take us to Lester's. Now that we're clear, I can probably tell you people. I didn't think we were gonna make it out of there. Uh, one of us didn't. We lost a duel, man. Oh, yeah, shit. You sure he's dead? There's no chance that... Man, yeah, he's dead. And probably could do by now. Like it should have been me. It, I, I should have been the one. It should have been me. Look, man, he was unlucky. And we all got lucky. By rights, none of us should have got out. That's all it is. Well, anyway, we made it out. So we got that to be thankful for. Daryl's people will get his paycheck and the standard expenses. Hey, man, it was our fault Daryl went down. Really? Why's that? Didn't you speak to the guy? Nothing was his fault, so it, uh, it must have been us, right? Uh, <laughs> I'll put it down to bad leadership then. I can tell you that, because the leader was dumb enough to take you in there. True that. This Lester crib, ain't it? I'm gonna go home and process all of this. <laughs> well, what? I never thought I'd see you clowns again. We did it! <laughs> Fucking A right, we did it! Ow! How was it? For a suicidally dangerous mission impersonating emergency services while working a high security government facility, it was surprisingly uplifting. <laughs> <laughs> Come here. Give me oh. some of that. Hey. Ow, 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 ow. Oh. Sorry, I forgot. You forgot <laughs> my very, very obvious illness? It happens. Uh, whatever. Hey, let's get drunk. Franklin, fill up the glasses. Got some real vintage moonshine, hillbilly type shit. We're gonna be seeing triple and committing incest in minutes. <laughs> just the shit to make a man forget his trouble. Oh, exactly. I am just gonna get drunk as a skunk, and then I'm gonna reverse engineer a webcam and spy on those sorority girls again. <laughs> I'm oh. ill, okay? Give me a break! Cheers! <laughs> <coughs> man, that's some foul ass shit. Oh. <laughs> All right, boys, I hate to break up the ritual, but I gotta go square things up with Davy and Dick uh, For serious? Hey, I just want them to know that now that we did this thing for them, and we have the evidence that we did this thing for them, that we can all go our own separate ways, you know? Well, fuck it. You want me to go with you, dog? No, stay. Have fun. I gotta do this alone. Right now. The sooner the better. It's one way to look at it, eh? Right. <laughs> Besides, I want to put this shit to bed. Then I can figure out Trevor, you know? Get my life back. Go back to being bored and miserable and loving every motherfucking minute of it. Here, enjoy the incest juice. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you boys sure know how to put the fun back in midlife crisis.